Mrs. Mommy. Hello, Mrs. Mommy. Hello, Mrs. Mommy. You're the best mommy. You're the best mommy. So that's our kittens. These, I don't know exactly what they are. They're going to be some kind of, I don't know, aster, goldenrod, something that blooms in the fall. This is corn. I just planted this all together. These are my flea banes, and they're still blooming. I can't tell if that's a real ladybug or if it's one of those fake ladybugs. So that's all my flea bane in a pot that I rescued from my lawn more of these things. I have no idea what they're going to be. Something that blooms in the fall. This stuff is Virginia bugle weed, I think it's called. And it doesn't have much of a smell except whenever it dries out. And like after the um, plant is all dried out and you crush it, it just has kind of a pleasant fragrance and it looks like it's some kind of mint and it's I think in one of the mint families so that one's I don't know some more of that stuff we're gonna find out this stuff is okay I think I think it's native and I think it's something called clear weed and the stem is kind of clear, like translucent. You can almost see through it. So this garden is a mixture of a mixture of native and invasive foreign plants. I was able to get a lot of raspberries and actually eat them from my raspberry bushes, which are everywhere here now. Oh, I have a pokeberry. There's a big pokeberry bush that's going to appear. Some sort of aster. My asparagus, which I hardly ate any of. I ate just a tiny bit of it. Tons of chicory, like a little too much. I started with like just one and now I have like one, two, three, for, I don't know, like five clumps, five or six giant clumps of chicory now. This is prickly lettuce and it's invasive and I'm gonna, I don't know, it's edible. I could do something with it. But mostly I'm just ignoring them. Um, these things are like black-eyed Susans or brown-eyed Susans or something. I don't know how to, how to tell the difference, but they're native. This I think is something native, but it's all been like eaten and chewed up. Oops, I'm not even looking at it. It's all been eaten and chewed up. It's just some wild native weed. This is my bone set, and it's a good happy thing that I was looking for for a long time. This, I don't know what it is, it's like sumac or something? I don't know, it kind of appeared 
and it's getting out of control and I'm gonna have to cut it down because I don't really want actual trees growing in my weed garden like this one for example <laughs> this is a mulberry tree and it got huge very quickly these are my maidenhair ferns and some normal ferns that I can't remember you know bracken type ferns I don't know what they are and my rattlesnake oh my gosh I touched one of the seeds of the jewelweed I didn't know it was there <laughs> and it popped um, these are all my rattlesnake plantains they're an orchid so I have a bunch of flowers for those so anyway that's that I don't think I'm in the picture. I'm never in the picture. These are my little... Well, not this. I have no idea what this one is. It's something random that appeared. But these are all my little fizzless plants. And they all need to be transplanted somewhere so that they can grow. And then these things have like random stuff in them that died and I don't want to talk about that. That was unpleasant. I'm not happy. <laughs> I killed a bunch of plants. Not happy. So my weed garden that I love so much and want to just increase a lot more. Okay and oops what that's an ant. Ants. I seriously doubt I'm in the picture. I'm never in the picture. But I am going to get someone to help me clean up this house because it's absolutely horrible. Like this floor is just like covered with so much dirt like the litter boxes, you know, they haven't been changed. The kittens are still using them, even though they're out. They're knocking trash down into the litter boxes. And this is like an overflowing trash can. This is normal at my house. This is a bed, but it's covered with so much junk, it's being used as a storage area. And this here is also a bed being used as a storage area. And, you know, well, my shower actually works. I have water, running water, and I have a hot water heater now. So this is nice. This is my shower. I don't have to go to the bathhouse to take a shower. Oh, hey, now I can see them in the picture. I'm just going to have to do it that way all the time. All right. <laughs> so... Anyway, and more like dishes, not washed, even though we have running water now, still not done, can't use the dishes, can't use, cook anything. <coughs> Over here is like food that I could potentially use, you know, like there's a spice, you know, spices here, like for example, this is garlic, like what the hell am I doing with garlic? I'm not doing anything with garlic. I've just got like so much stuff in here that's just not being used. It drives me crazy. And more stinky trash cans with like ants in them on cat food. There's my kitties. And like this giant pile of stuff is where I sleep and I've been keeping these Venetian blinds closed all the time but I don't like to do that technically I like having them open but okay I didn't really have anything specific to say I was just showing the plants mostly